Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Marmoset, and Punch Jard is wearing a very silly helmet and unbalancing some pizzas because he needs to earn some cash. We're in a situation where basically this is all kind of maxed out right now, so we're just going to burn some cash and stock that fridge with meat. We're going to fill our fridge with meat. Get up to the next tick. We'll finish this run, and then we're going to get some some sleep and some rest and all the other bits and pieces. Stop. All right. We need to head to the shop, or I would like to buy as much meat as I possibly can. Moose are having us a little bit, so it's fine. Moose pretty good. And some. When we got our next fight in two days, that's coming up tomorrow. I'd love to get that sorted, so we'll probably be heading to the gym. Once we go past the next tick, I was heading for the city map. Just out of interest, how much are some of these goods? Right, so small punch bag is 150. And the Wing Chun. This is the kind of ratio I want, actually, but at the moment I'm trying to focus on strength and stamina, so I'm actually going to do some push ups on my flat. And you want $40 for each of your potions. I am kind of tempted to give them a try. So let's do this. Let's go back to here. Go by foot. Talk to you. Deliver pizza for one set. Stop. No, oh, it says stop. Balls. <laughs> stop doing that. Go home. Sleep. So we're going to sleep until we're hungry. We're going to chug a potion. And then hit the gym for the rest of the day. It only costs 10. Potions cost 40, so we have enough cash. Eat meat twice. Don't want to fight just yet. Head for here. I will talk to you. I would like to buy a blue potion. It is magical. Who does it might increase? Magic is a dangerous thing. Magic potion. It tastes okay, but the effects and the effects are good. But I would suggest going easy with magic stuff. So we've now got agility 10 for quite a while. Let's find out. I mean, that's a 2, so I'm assuming it's going to last for 2 days. We're going to head to the gym. We're going to go in the gym. We're going to hit that, and then we are going to get on the punch bag. This is a very solid 8 bit something noise we've got there. Get stamina up to three. I don't think we're going to get strength up to two. We might do if we just focus on that briefly. There we go. Let's go fight. Fighting Kick Sloan. We are Punch Jard. Hello, Punch. I am Kick. Hello, Kick. I am Punch. You are suit of armor guy. Strike modifier. All your strikes deal more damage to your opponent's energy. Because you know, it blocks more damage. Alright, so you are a turtle character. You are all about your energy. And you recover it quite a bit faster than I do. Well, I'm all about doing damage to your face. Because I have a rain of strikes. Back in that punch. I'm going to multi kick you. Blocking is 25% less effective. That works for a character who's all about the blocking. So that's rain of strikes firing. Every single time we hit. hit. So he's got this one, which does debuff stamina. All right, I'm not too fussed about that. Ouch, 14 points here against me. So we've just gone down to the point where he was around us, and he were winning the energy war against that piece of stamina character, which is pleasing to see. Come on, knock him down, knock him down, knock him down. Just before the round end, ah, drat. See, this actually went up for a change because we've got some actual stamina. 
Yep, four points of damage for missing me. Because I come in up underneath you. Come on. So he's changed that to skip attack because he's running low on energy, which is something I don't have. Come on, get the punch in. Alright, so now we're in the energy loss stage where I have very little energy and he's got plenty, but I only need to get a couple more hits in. Come on, just kick him. Thank you! Seven points, that's what we want to see. League change went up nicely. Took a bit of damage, but not that much. Nothing we can't recuperate from. So I'll sign up for that. Our ultimate fight is tomorrow. So we're going to be just chaining fights back to back at the moment. I think it's the last two days, so we're in a pretty good state. Um, we should probably... Given the fight happens immediately... Stick back into the gym. Pay the money. And just get straight on to... We wanted something that did strength and stamina, didn't we? Let's just double check these, because I know that's pure stamina. That's pure agility. That's mostly... Stamina and this. And one thing we can do is we need to get our agility up to 13 at the very end of this. It's a massive 650 boost um, from the potion. Um, is that we can abuse that slightly. Let's run the clock down on this one. And that we can use the potion. So we can get ourselves up to 11 and then we can slug a magic potion to get ourselves up to 13. Rather than having to worry about actually trying to train ourselves up the way up to 13. We're only get... Running around with a 10 on this for a few uh, days isn't going to be too much of a problem for us. Alright, so I wanted a set of threes at the moment. Go back over here. Ah, there's strength and stamina. Mostly needs strength, but that's good to see. Child, get me a three ten three. There we go. So our accuracy is now one point nine. We go to our skill set and have a look. Ah, uh, eight points of damage now for five points of energy. So, uh, yeah. So it's in that the cost is increasing with the amount of damage you're doing. So that's why we're running a little low on that. But uh, let's give this a go. Fight. It's Roy. You're fighting in the, the league that's all about pain. That's, really, that's probably a good idea. Yep, so uh, that combo did the damage. He then missed, and I got in under his uh, guard. 18, 25. Always oh, hit me back there. But missed and took some damage. The uh, that armor penetration is coming in very handy. There's a man of energy. Up he gets. And there goes the round, unfortunately. He's dropped a skip attack because he desperately needs trying to recover his energy. This is something I should probably have a look at getting. But, you know, winning is fun. Two more skill points, chunk of cash. Didn't lose that much on this. 100% hit rate with that, but he wasn't using it very much. Nice. Mr. Y. Just like you if I hadn't burnt my face. Well, that's a reference to. So many fighting film references. Just pleased I got the uh, the chef one for the two days, three days. All right, so this is going to run out in a day. What to do? It's Don's the bar. Yeah, let's go beat someone up in the bar while we're while we're feeling pretty awesome about ourselves. I right, to test myself. Okay, just some guy three two three. Well, you're going down in a big pile of pain. Why? Because I'm, I'm farming you for skill points. Wow, look at that. Just at the 40 point, 41 point combo with a counter attack. 31 point combo. Yeah, this is this is a really good measure of how far Punch Shard has progressed just by how quickly we obliterated that guy for those skill points. It's hard to find any other points for you. You are now the best among us. Street Fighter, you did it. You won five, five times. I always believe in you. By the way, I think you are a good guy. Pleasure to hear. <laughs> hmm? Mickey.
Alright, so he's Fight Club. Oh, right, twin brother. Okay, right. So the reference for this one is Brad Pitt played Tyler in Fight Club. He also played Mickey from Snatch. So that's why the guy's the twin brother. Let's go to the biker camp. There, that's Mickey. So it's that's another character played by Brad Pitt, who's also a fighter. Metroid looks like a good guy. Better be careful. <laughs> All right. I'll talk to Bobo. All right. I wonder what the gift is going to be. Hi, are you Bobo? Oh dear, the man has a baseball bat. He is a dog. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Big sex is stupid. <laughs> nice. Wow, 857. Um, well, unless we get stupidly lucky, I mean, he's got nearly twice as many hit points as us. That baseball bat, he's didn't hit me with a baseball bat, he's punched me instead. Alright. There's the baseball bat coming up with a 27 hit combo. I said I just 23 points down on him. 8. Yeah, he's doing a lot of damage when he hits me, but I'm 37 because I've got the counter attack in. Am I going to get his... Oh, I nearly had a chance where I got his energy out, but unfortunately we are going to run out of energy. You can whiff all you want, but then you smash me for a 25, which hurts. I think we might be getting skip attack. There we go. That was closer than I thought it was going to be. That was a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> so funny and weak. Yeah, I, I got closer than you bloody well think. Um, yeah, I really need to go home and rest. That energy level, that health level is really low. And what does this do? I just sit. So it improves mood nothing else really. Alright, well that was a bit of a waste of time. Potion hasn't quite worn off yet. You're hungry. Alright, that's fine. I think I filled the fridge with meat. I did. Sleep some more. So we run that sleep out. That should give us... We should eat more meat. Yeah, no. Put on that. A slug of meat. Should bring that back up a fair bit. Our health is still down 50%, so it looks like we'll probably be doing some generic working for a living rather than heading to the biker camp. Any fights? That's in two days. That's going to wear off and crash that down. Let's go to Roy's house. Hello, Roy. Interesting. How many skill points do I need for the next one? Because we've decided that we need a skip attack because we're running out of energy at what we could describe as a disturbing rate. So we need two more. Hello, Roy. Would you like to spar? You're going to say... Car. Alright, fair enough. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll fix your car. But by your definition of car fixing means lamming it with a sledgehammer. Basically, I'm just here to have my health tick up a bit. Just kill some time. Probably get my ass handed to me in the next fight. Yep, you're helping. <laughs> you could go out to the bar. Sod it, let's go to the bar. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Alcohol and swirly things, and pizza and swirly things. Right, to improve my mood, crash those a little bit. Fair enough. Not bad, got my health up a little bit. Killed a bit of time. I don't know if that actually helped very much. 
Because what I want to do is spar. Alright, so I fixed your truck. And he wants to fight. Alright, we're not looking too bad. Let's get their skill points and grab that skip attack so we can drop that in for probably Rain of Strikes. So we can just spend a bit of time not doing anything for a bit. When we start running low on energy. Yeah, you miss all you want. Every time you miss, there's a half decent chance I do a bit more damage to you. That's why I'm spiky. Combo, 17 combo, 9. Yeah, numbers are slightly offset a little bit there. That's a win! There's my two skill points. And there is skip attack. Which is what I want to do. Because we end up with lots of points where we're just out of energy. Right, we have a fight tomorrow. We're looking pretty good on that. We've got plenty of cash. Do you want to head to the gym, Roy? Way more effective. You still need to fix my car. Alright, fine. I've got a few bits of the day left where I can just wail on your engine for a bit. Apparently, I didn't do help for very much. Get our training on. To the gym, Roy! What on earth is wrong with that engine that we need to? beat it with a sledgehammer. I mean, how out of alignment could it possibly be? Right. That one. I'm going to run that out, because that'll boost all three of my stats in the way I like. A little bit of stamina, a fair bit of agility, and just a little bit of strength. Get myself a 383. <laughs> Yeah, and that's the potion wearing off. And then we'll... Oh, no. Still need to get that up. And your... Board of that. Alright, pop that to a three. And then grab that. get bored of it. Just keep going. Keep going! Faster. Punch, 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 punch. I suspect we might run out of food. You really can stay on that to rig for quite a while. Can we get to nine before you need to get hungry? Uh, yeah, hungry. Alright, let's stuff an energy bar in our faces and see if we can't get that to a 9. Uh, protein bar. Great job, keep it going. I ate a protein bar, Roy. <laughs> there we go, 9. See the dude's coming. Pumping iron, nice. Alright, um, let's take that fight. 393. We're fighting. It's Mr. Kazuki again. Ah, uh, Mr. Kazuki. Alright, so we'll run with this and then we'll drop switch, um, skip attack in for a bit. If he hasn't beaten me in a single round. Alright, just spending a bit of time building up some energy. It's not a bad idea. He's going to do it a damn sight faster than you can. So we will drop... I tempted to just literally just go completely defensive for a round. I don't think I'm going to win anyway. So I generally want to see what this does. Alright, that did a thing. 
didn't necessarily work out as much as I would like to. Let's um drop the counter attack and put in the kicking. Yeah, as, as, as much of the counter attacking is working, it's quite nice. It should just be extra tick damage. It shouldn't be something we're trying to rely on. We can't literally just go for a position where you just dodge your way to victory. See, but then the fact, well, I mean, we've got six skill points out of doing that. Still did lose, and our health is now absolutely crashed again. We will be skipping that fight with this low health, which is going to take a bit of damage. Alright, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I have been the Marmoset. I keep clicking on the wrong button while I'm trying to talk. We need to go home and sleep. I've been the Marmoset. This has been Punch Club. We're playing with Punch Jarred. Please remember to like, comment, and or subscribe.